video was brought to you by G2A.com for cheap games, MSP, and PSN codes. And powered by Elgato Gaming. For the best gameplay capture out there, pick up an Elgato capture card today. Links in the description. Hey guys, how's it going? Masterbucks here. Welcome to another 2025 career mode video with a regen. And today, that player is going to be Cristiano Ronaldo. Of course, guys, Cristiano Ronaldo, one of the best players in the world right now, just behind one other bloke. But anyway, we'll move on. I've always wanted to do a Cristiano Ronaldo 2025, and believe me guys, I've attempted it many, many times. The only problem is, he always retires. It's very hard to stop him from retiring or to really try to keep him in the game all the way to 2025. It's basically been very, almost impossible for me. So, unfortunately, I haven't been able to do one with him. But, we can do one with his regen. It won't necessarily be to 2025, obviously, because for me, Ronaldo retired in the 7th or 8th season, one of those uh, one of those two. So we are going to go all the way to 2030, which is the end of career mode, to see what his rating is going to be in, 20, uh, in 2030. So let's begin this then with the first season, with the Ronaldo regen. We're going to take a look at him, and of course, he is a 78, or he was a 78 overall when we got him, of course. Now he's 79 and uh, at the end of the first season, of course, we see... Brilliant stats like the finishing already up in the 90s. Ball control and dribbling, you knew that was great. Free kick accuracy as well. The physical attributes are absolutely insane. Everything is almost at 80. It's absolutely crazy. 21 years of age now. And then you've got so many other great technical attributes. The penalties are up there, of course. So pretty decent, of course. You know it's a Ronaldo region there. And it's uh, the curve and a bunch of other great stats as well. Free kick accuracy. What a brilliant region. Immediately straight off the bat. A sensational start for Pedro Miguel Mesquita Lopez. I reckon I might just call him Pedro if you blokes are alright with that, but either way, or the Ronaldo regen, whatever works better, whatever I'm up to, but still, we've got the Cristiano Ronaldo regen going up now by plus two in this season, and we see the mental and the technical going up again, no physical attribute growth, but again, I really do not even care if they grow at all, because seriously, they're just already that great. Anyway, now 81 and two, uh, two plus overall increase, with excellent form, very happy morale, 22 years of age now in the 80s as well, the ball control is in the 90s, the curve is brilliant, the penalties keep going up. Up as well. Finishing's at 92. Dribbling. Free kick accuracy is great. What a Ronaldo region. How about this for a Ronaldo region? What if I told you that he didn't have five-star skill moves? Would that sort of maybe put you off? Because unfortunately, I think he's only got like three-star skill moves. He doesn't really have the tech is like Ronaldo, but oh my god, he's got the stats. And he's really, a in the end, a pretty good uh, little regen. Because sometimes the regens of certain players in career mode can often go in a different direction, maybe not have the sort of reflections of the player they're, rege uh, they're regenerated of. But this guy definitely is a Ronaldo regen. You know that. He's got almost all the standout qualities of Ronaldo in real life. But still, this is the third season with, of course, the Ronaldo region before we skip all the way ahead to the end of career mode. And it is another plus two overall increase. 83 at 23 years of age. Remember, this is without player training as well. We see the physical attributes go up by a little bit. We see the pace getting even better. The agility going up as well. Mental too as well. And now things like ball control now in the 93. We've got finishing at 94. Free kick accuracy, it just keeps on getting better. Shot power, passing improving. Obviously, the passing is not fantastic. Again, very reminiscent of Ronaldo, I guess. Ha, ha, ha. But still, penalties going up, hitting the 90s, very close to that. Curve, so many other great stats. What a freaking regen. This could go, this could, this guy maybe is probably the best regen I've seen so far. He's a high rating, of course, at the start, but oh my God, what a player. But the time has come now to go all the way to 2030, the very end of career mode with the Ronaldo regen. How good does he get without player training? Let's take a look. So here we are, 2030 with Cristiano Ronaldo's region. Of course, I've wanted to say that for so, so long, guys, you have no idea, but finally, it's gonna happen. We're gonna get to see him. What's his rating in 2030? It's an 87 overall going up by plus one in this season, of course. 26 years of age. That's the oldest that he got to, of course. This is 2030, so you know there is no going further than this. This is the end of career mode. This is the highest that we got him to. And take a look at him. Ball control, 98. Finishing, 97. Penalties, 92. You look at the free kick accuracy and the dribbling, all the 91s as well. The physical attributes, they're all above 80. Everything, the pace is insane. Agility, jumping, so much great, so many great stats. Stamina, reaction, strength, he's got it. Oh, it's insane. And then some brilliant technical attributes as well. He looks too good even for an 87 rated left winger. That's how freaking amazing he is. He's got so many amazing stats in the 90s. So many really, really good stats in the 90s as well. This makes him such an insane player. Pedro, he's, oh wow, what a regen. 
And the scary thing too is if the career mode didn't stop in 2030, he would have kept on growing and he would have got to the 90s since he is of course the regen of Cristiano Ronaldo. And since he's only 26, he absolutely would have got he would have gotten even better than that. Imagine him with three or four more seasons under his belt. You would be looking at a freak, an unreal human being, an incredible specimen. But sadly, that's not the case. The career mode does end in 2030 and so does this video. Thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And of course, let me know any other regions you want to see of course in uh, 2020. 25 or in 2030 of course and until next time my name is Master Bucks have a good one bye bye